So we're just doing 20 questions. My name's 906 Hammy. This is DJ Matt M. Even though you don't like DJ. This, it's fucking lame. This, Whoever puts DJ in front of your fucking name, dude. 19 fucking. He's not a DJ. Called. He's a professional party animal. Entertainer. Who knows how to make good seats on a fucking board. You know how to do shit on that fucker, for real. For I remember real. that one time in Albuquerque, bro. You blew my mind, for real. We got Reed making hawk tune noises in the background. He's That's like a cheese. You know. So anyways, I'm Matt M, and we're going to do 20 questions. <coughs> yep. But uh, first we're going to do it. Who are you guys? I'm 906 Ham. 906 to the H-A-M-M-Y. Like S N O O P D O. That's big ham, not the little one. Man. That's big ham, not the little one. Two tone cardio match the nails, ho. What he said? I'm Dubsack. It's D U B B S A Q. And I'm Matt. If you don't know how to spell my name, you're a fucking idiot. Well, then we got Reed Stanton. We don't like to put him on camera because YouTube's got, you know, rules and stuff that you can't put ugly ass people on the camera and shit. So we gang, keep him off. Gang. You take this? All right. What's the questions, dude? Let's get All this right. underway. If you could only use one food item in your lyrics for the rest of your career, what would it be? Asparagus. <laughs> cheeseburger. Why cheeseburger? Because I want, I want beef and I want cheddar. I feel it. I want problems and I want the money. Because what's shit. the word? If you want problems, it's what's the word? It's what's the <laughs> But I'm also trying to get to that bag, you feel me? All right. What about you, Dove Stack? Bro, well, there's a spider Watch out asparagus. Yeah. Because I wake up early, my piss smell like asparagus. You know, I'm about to blow because I am a fucking terrorist. I don't buddy. Oh, damn. What are you doing? Reed, bro. <laughs> what the fuck? He just caught a body on camera, bro. <laughs> Fed as fuck. Oh, I gotta go. <laughs> <laughs> I know how you I fucking work. Work. <laughs> If your rap career was a sitcom, what would the title be? A sitcom. <laughs> And these happy endings, dude. 100%. Phone on silent. You know, business. Dubby Days. I mean, it would just be like a like, psychedelic sitcom so. called Dubby Days, but Days, D A Z E. It was gonna be about us, on, we just tripping the whole time. If you had a battle rap against any animal, what would you choose? Woodpecker. Reed Stan. <laughs> <laughs> big bird. <laughs> Very close outside, big bird. <laughs> big mom's in a hurt, big hurt. Yeah. <laughs> Anyway, so what's your go-to dance move when you're trying to impress the press the ladies? I just be grabbing their hand, turning them around, and I just be letting them throw that motherfucker. Out. I just be I just be moving with their hips. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, why you skin ass? Oh god! I usually bark at them and shit. That's how you know. Amen. This is, if you could only listen to one song for the rest of your life, but it has to be a cheesy pop song, which one would it be? Oh, that's such a good one. So I have one by Vanessa Hutchins where it's like, making my way to town, walking around. That's not the Yeah, it is. Uh -uh. <laughs> that's Vanessa Carlton or something. Okay, then her. That one. Or Party in the USA with Miley Cyrus. Like that one, yes. Okay. Yes. Okay, we can agree. But I gotta be drunk twenty four seven. For real. Yeah. You know what? Fuck it, bro. Put me on some slow rider. Yo, that's that's for real. I grew up on that shit. What's the most embarrassing song you secretly love to jam out to? Just I say like it. Sexy red. No, yeah. Get it sexy. Get it sexy. <laughs> Get it sexy. <clears throat> you, you guys think sexy red is like? Yeah, yeah. That's my dream girl. I'll marry her for real. If you had to create a hip hop themed board game, what would it be called? Rapopoly. I think that's kind of taken. I'll be charging all you bitch ass dudes for features. Trench Quest. <laughs> we call it Trench Quest. Trench, trench Quest? Yeah, you gotta sell apes and move your way up. I like that. That's actually a good idea. I'll front you in the game. We can start. What's your guilty guilty pleasure when it comes to music outside of hip hop? Like, so, like, what do you Jazz. Jazz? Jazz. Jazz? Country. Like jazz. I actually like jazz. Charlie Wilson. Country. Hammy put me on a country. Country. I had, bro, like, when we did our song, I had no idea what country was. All right, if you could have any superpower but only while rapping, what would it be? Confidence, bro. <sighs> X-ray vision. Web yes, that's like... Webbed feet. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Explain more. 
I'll be rapping at the lake and shit. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> rapping underwater. What's the most ridiculous outfit you've ever worn on stage? Definitely that pink cheetah print shit. Grub sack merch. I wore a gorilla suit. Really? I humped Tommy Sunshine while he did a set Thursday night at even further, like 2000. I don't remember. I was really drunk. If you could swap lives with any celebrity for a day, who would it be, and what's the first thing you do? I think I'd yeah, that's a hard one. I'd switch to Johnny Sins and fuck the baddest porn star bitch on earth. Fair enough. The Pope. What do you think the Pope does all day? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? The Pope? Wake up, eat some bread, drink some wine, chill. I'd have a peaceful out there. I go to the spa or something. Yeah, I'd be the Pope. Alright. Church. All right, All right, uh what's the funniest misunderstanding that you've had with a fan? When they compare me to somebody else. But one time, um wait, funniest misunderstanding. This bitch thought I was twenty five and tried to fuck me. I still fucked her. <laughs> oh, that's not funny, bro. That's a war story. I don't give a fuck. Respect. Bro, we need that for another episode. Right? If you had to choose a snack to represent your latest album, what would it be? Passion Fruit. The One Chip Challenge. That shit was hot. Real yeah. Stuff. You can tell these guys are rappers. Like, you guys just come up with the greatest analogies and stuff. No fucks given. Where's the cart? All right, what's the weirdest compliment you've received about your music? I fucked my girlfriend to your music. Yeah. Or I've had sex to one of your songs. Or your song made me break up with my girlfriend. Don't worry, it's okay though. Uh, I don't have fans. You'll get there, homie. Don't worry about it. One day, I don't have fans. Look me up, bro. D U B B S A Q. Tap in. Follow my boy Dubsack all platforms. I'm signing him in two months. Nine oh six W. 50 grand. I'm He's gonna move me out the there. Chain. He's still be making it in some people's eyes around there, dude. Oh, if you oh. could only use emojis to describe your latest project, which ones would you choose? A hundred emoji, fire emoji, the wave emoji. Are you blinking her, buddy? Holy fuck, two for one, special, Wendy's. You want honey mustard or ranch? <coughs> oh, good, primo. What would your rapper <laughs> name be if you were a country singer instead? It'd just be my name. No, my you gotta have name. Yeah. You wanna know my you know, like, how some artists have different names for no, different bro. genres. If I was a country like, singer, like Mac Miller had name. like five aliases. He had Larry Fisherman, Larry Lovestein, motherfucking uh, yeah. I just go by D or that would be It would just be Caden. Caden Vargas. If I was a country singer on me. But bro, I ain't gonna lie, I got some real fire country shit in the mix. Bitch ass dude. On butter. Oh, bro, D U double B. <laughs> what would your uh, name of your rap album be if it was based on the worst cookie disaster? Cam's mishap. Double fuck mess. <laughs> Fair enough. <laughs> <laughs> What's your go-to karaoke song, and can you bust out a verse? Regulator. Bust out what? the verse. Whatever. We gotta do it, bro. Do you see me doing karaoke? Regulator. Uh, Ross, uh, Ramona. No, no. You did karaoke? Dude, look at my TikTok. Dude, karaoke. We gotta do karaoke <laughs> before we fucking leave. I know we play at Bar and Grills on this tour. What's the funniest nickname you ever been given? And who gave it to you? Hammy. And my... Shout out Danny Birch, man. So, why, why are you... Why, okay, let's, why, are we, why are you called Hammy? You ever see the movie The Sandlot? Yeah. I used to look like Ham. Ham Porter. Hamilton Porter. I used to look like him. And I used to be a catcher in baseball. So one day, me and Danny, we were playing catch, and he was like, you remind me of the fucking catcher from the Sandlot, and we started geeking out, because he was like, he was like, what's his name? I was like, Reggie. <laughs> and we ended up going back to school, we, we see each other in the hallway, and I'd be like, fucking Reggie, how you doing, Reg? Reggie, Reggie Oxafree. And he'd be like, he'd be like, ham, ham sandwich, ham porter. But then when I started rapping, I, I, I it was so, so like fast to think of my rap name, I was like, Cause I wanted it to be serious, but a joke at the same time. And I, I ain't gonna lie, I got uh, seen too many movies. I got my movies. name Dubsack, cause I got two nuts. What's yeah. the craziest thing you've done to get out of a bad situation on stage? Laughing that my mom got into a car accident. 
Wait, it's like not perform or like to get off stage? I guess that too. I guess that works. I was kind of crunched on time before canceled because I knew I wouldn't make it. What the hell is that? I'm gonna have so much fun editing. Dude, this what is going on? Edit it, bro. Okay, I'm gonna make a fire ass. Yeah, about to die? You mean enough to I'll work with? I'll grab that fucker by the neck. <laughs> it sounds like. Yeah, you should put them in their place. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, they heard that. They're like, <laughs> you have any. Ugh. What animal would you have as your sidekick in a rap battle? I'm done with this animal shit. Yeah, I'm not it's really just the question. You know what? Give so me a I got Joey. These questions give me a baby kangaroo. AI chat bot. What? Give me a baby kangaroo. Give me a Joey. Give me a woodpecker, bro. Or that thing. Give me that thing. Whatever that is. I want that. Kill? You want a little ass bug? I want an El Chupacabra. Did you, know, you guys ever say anything like, uh, accidentally like embarrassing on stage? Yeah. Fuck yeah. I've fallen off stage. I have before. a lot because I drink every time I. I've perform, said some so. embarrassing ass yeah, shit on that stage before. I remember the first tour. I said some bitch was like, I was like, I'm I go by the name of nine oh six ham. She's like, ham sandwich. I said, ham sandwich. I said, call me ham sandwich. Call me whatever you want. Just don't call me broke. And everyone just kind of looked at me weird, and I was like, Ugh. <laughs> one time in the uh, portage, I fell off stage, but it was on beat. And I like pushed myself back up kind of on beat, but everybody was laughing at me. If you could have dinner with a fic fictional character, who would it be in the uh, Fictional steak, right? Yeah, I think. Yeah. Franklin? <laughs> Harry Potter or a genie of some sort? Oh, I don't know. Think hard? Thinking. Stitch? Stitch. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. <laughs> Alright, last question. What's coming up? Like What's what's new? Like yeah, just send it off. Like, Scooby Doo, Scooby Doo. What the fuck is Me and W got a fucking album coming out soon. We're on this five day tour. We're about to rock out shows in some states that we've never performed in. I ain't never performed in Kansas. I've been in Kansas. We've been in Missouri, right? I performed in Missouri before, and I performed in Indiana. Just gonna be in Wichita. Put a tap in. Don't be lasting. Hit the link right there. Oh yeah. That's, yes, where, that's where we made that video in Kansas. Remember, I was like, tap in, don't be lying, shit, and took your leg right ADD now. going on. <laughs> right and the video. And the video, Debbie. <laughs> <laughs> this is going to be great. <laughs> I'm telling you. Every time I've tried to, I've tried, five more. I've tried three oh. times.